Like he, uh, Coach Smart talked about, you know, the approach getting ready for this Orange Bowl and having the same routine. Just what have you seen from this team? How you guys have been prepared for this bowl game and just the efforts these last few weeks? Um, the same way as every other week, everybody attacking practice and um, basically not looking at it as um, just trying to go out there and have another opportunity to, um, to finish the year all right. I know some of these freshmen have only been here a couple of days, but it's only taken a couple of days sometimes. Have any of these guys flashed automatically some of these early rules? Uh, it's kind of tough to see right now. Ben they just got thrown out of fire. So um, I think um, then we going through the spring, you'll be able to see a little bit more. Taiki, what has the, the the mood been like in those workouts? I remember talking to you right after the, the Alabama game. You, you looked like you were ready to go out and play another game that night. It, has, has it been that chomping at the bit opportunity for these guys to to want to play again together? No, yeah, definitely. Uh, so the workouts, everybody been like I said, everybody been attacking the workouts in practice, the same as um, in the end season game. So it ain't really no difference. It, just wondering how a guy like you who has NFL uh, aspirations, I mean, could you come back if you wanted to, and are you still making those kind of decisions? Uh, so I ain't really been focused on that right now. I've been trying to just take it uh, one day at a time and uh, kind of live with my feet right now. Yeah, how do you do it? By, I mean, you just don't even think about that the next um, stage yet. Just focus on the bowl game right now, and then um, kind of go from there after that. Yeah, it's like, yeah, I'm just curious. They, they've had several opt-outs to get the wide receiver position. How do you go about preparing for an offensive unit that you don't really know what you're going to get? Um, so I'm pretty they, um, on tape. They got some guys. Uh, they got different guys that's uh, going to be stepping up now on tape that play. Uh, so we're looking at we're looking at like any other game. Uh, still preparing the same and uh, like like I said, the other guys that he got got experience that they played throughout the season. Uh, you say you're approaching it like any other game. Is it hard to get motivated, though, when it's not a playoff game? I mean, that's what you guys uh, were going through these last two years. And do you think it, we, are you planning to watch the playoff games, or are you just focused on your own? Um, no, we, um, we, we like I said, we're preparing like the um, like as any game. Uh, so if it was a playoff game or regular bowl game, we're going to prepare the same way. And then, yeah, I definitely plan on watching the playoff game. On the topic of opt-outs, obviously, Florida State having some – why do you think it is that y'all haven't had any? Um, the connection. Um, people trying to play for one another, uh, playing with something bigger than yourself and trying to represent the, the G if it's that, uh, if it's that, if it's their last time wearing it or not, or deciding to come back. So I think that's the biggest reason. Being that you're someone yourself who's gone through that transfer process, did any of the guys that have entered the transfer portal or anyone that is considering like come to you for advice or ask like suggestions in terms of how to handle it and the way to go about that process? Uh, no, nobody came to me uh, to advice, but um, wish those guys the best at um, with their future and uh, with their uh, future plans. Anything else for Tyke? All right, thank you. Thanks, Thank you. Thank you.